Hi friends. So first we need to add apt key. So for that we have to run this command duplicate hyphen q or then this url pipe sudo apt hyphen key add hyphen okay done so after that we need to add um, report to etc apt source hyphen sources dot list dot d so in this file Actually, we need to add uh, the report location. So, if you get that file, you can see this path here. So, that is what that echo command is doing. So, after that, we can run sudo apt update. Basically, it will update the, it will fetch the information from the URL which we added. That is what apt update is doing so after that basically we can install mongodb by running this command apt install mongodb hyphen org so let me run this command then type y and press enter so you can see it's installing mongodb shell server mongo s tools and then mongodb so i mean the main file okay instruction has completed after that uh, we have to start the service so we can run this command system ctl start mongod dot service then we can run uh, sctl enable so this will help us to automatically start the service when we reboot the system so after that just run mongo it will open the mongo shell so there you can run the commands like show dbs it will show all the you know, databases that these are the default database so if you want to exit just type exit so i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel please like and share the video so if you have any doubt please comment when you run mongo there you can see the version of mongodb which we installed basically it's showing the version of mongodb shell actually it installed the same version of mongodb server also so just run mongo then you will be able to find the version of mongodb which you installed we also specified the version 4.2 when we added that apt key and when we added that uh, a repo you can see them 4.2 there